A budget boot option for warmer climates that is waterproof enough for everyday winter use but lacks traction and stability for deep snow or trail adventures. While the Columbia Ice Maiden Roman II is one of the most lightweight, inexpensive options in our lineup, we weren't super impressed with the boot's performance in snow conditions. It is a good option for daily errands or a night on the town, but it doesn't hold up on trails with fresh or packed snow and couldn't keep our feet as warm as the majority of the other boots we tested. The Ice Maiden is, however, quite breathable and waterproof. While it may not stand total water submergence, it wicks away precipitation with ease. If you need something a bit more casual that won't leave your wallet completely empty, this is one to consider. The Columbia Ice Maiden Roman II is a good option for those who live in warmer winter climates and don't need a heavy-duty winter boot. It's also very affordable, making it a viable option for those who don't want to break the bank on a boot purchase. The Ice Maiden Roman II has a warm and fuzzy interior with a slipper-like feel. With 200 grams of insulation, it can keep your toes warm through wintry conditions, though it didn't maintain warmth for as long as we had hoped in our field tests. After trudging through fresh storm snow for an hour, our feet were quite cold, at only about 1 2 inch. The lack of thickness in the rubber sole means less insulation and thus a limited ability to retain heat. The Ice Maiden Roman II has a cold weather rating of 25 degrees Fahrenheit 32 Celsius, temperatures we weren't able to test in. But based on our time out in the field, we wouldn't expect this boot to provide enough warmth in such cold conditions. We were satisfied with the weatherproofing on the Ice Maiden regarding keeping snow out of the interior and keeping our feet dry. The boot offers 10 inches of upper to keep the leg protected to the mid shin, and the fur collar helps to stop snow and keep it out of the interior. The waterproofness is also impressive but not as robust as some of the tighter. Seam seal constructions on more expensive boots. When wading into a river, Flowing water easily worked its way into the tongue and through the laces at about 5 inches from the base of the boot. The exterior wicked away water from the outside, making it a viable option for rain and snow. But the Ice Maiden is not the best option for exploring wet or mucky trail areas. The Ice Maiden Roman II has an interesting feel compared to the other snow boots in our review. The structure of the midsole that hugs the outside of the foot has a cardboard-like feel. The boot feels fine once you walk around in it for a bit but the out-of-the-box fit is somewhat uncomfortable. 